Welcome back. Thank you for being here. Nice to see you. Uh, nice and, to see you. And thank you for doing the, the TikTok dance <laughs> challenge. Man, oh man, that's a lot of pressure. Uh, do people you dance? Did good. No, I didn't. But I'm do, proud of you. But when people are around you, like at a, at a party or a wedding, are, uh, it's intimidating, right? Do people even dance or they just leave the room? <laughs> Like, they do your move. Yeah. The one oh, yeah. that's like... They're just sneaking out. Yeah, sneaking out. <laughs> uh, uh, congrats on uh, Te Felicito. Uh, well said. Well pronounced. It, Have a good accent. It was good? Te Felicito. Perfect. Te Felicito. Yeah, it came out and uh, within a week it was the number one song. So congrats on that. I mean, come on. How do you do that? I, that's got to feel good, right? Yeah. I mean, I, I'm, I'm, yeah, I, you know, I don't put up music too often because to me, it's a priority to dedicate time to my kids. But when I do it, I focus. So, yeah, you do yeah, it right. Yeah, I had, to, I had to dedicate like three months to just prepare the video and... I love the video, by the way. Yeah. Where'd the concept of the video come from? Actually, you know, uh, the creators of the video are my kids. They, they are. came up with the idea. Uh, no way. Can you believe? Yeah, they are pretty yeah. creative kids. They just said, hey, no, what? You know, What to do? Yeah. Um, when I'm about to produce a, a video, it's like a white canvas, and I, I, I have to kind of like sit and think about what I'm gonna do. Yeah. And I had no idea what I wanted to do, so I asked my kids to listen to a song, close their eyes, yes. and listen to the song. And my little one, Sasha, came up with a robot idea. He said, "Mommy, I imagine you dancing with a robot." <laughs> and and Milan came up with the green fire, and I love those two ideas. And I took him to a director. And that was the whole, the departure. I want to show, I want to show a little, <laughs> uh, let me show the clip. Here's the clip of the music video, uh, Te Felicito. Check it out. I mean, come on. Dancing with the robot? Yeah, I think, I think kids are extremely creative, all of them. Yeah, they are. Us adults, we just have to take their ideas seriously. Yeah. Are, do you think they're going to grow up and be in the music business and be producers or musicians? I don't know. I don't know. And, and uh, I, I want them to do whatever they feel passionate about. But I would like for them to um, have music in their lives because music um, gives them so much. It's a good companion, you know, in yeah, life. Really it's a good refuge. It's a, it, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, it's always there for you. They learn yeah. the piano. They, they play the drums. Um, I heard when you were little, you almost didn't get into choir or something. Is that true? That's true, sadly. Yeah. Who, who wouldn't have Shakira in their choir? Really? My music teacher. He didn't wow. like my voice. He thought I was too disruptive for the choir because my voice was too strong. And uh, yeah, he never let me in the choir, and it was a huge frustration for me. Yeah. Um, and even my classmates teased me. They used to tease me, and they used to say that I, that I sang like a goat. <laughs> I hope it was a cute goat. Though. Yeah. <laughs> but... now, now you are the goat. So there you go. You did. <laughs> Show them. Well, you know, my parents... the global music superstar. Well, you know, it was it was pretty hard because it was some sort of. Uh, I think it was some, some, a way of bullying, you know? Like, I, sure. I felt bullied in a way. Yeah. Um, but... Did you almost think I, about not going forward, not, not singing? Well, thanks to my parents, I didn't. Because my, my parents actually reinforced and, and, and reaffirmed my, my identity as a singer. And they, they were... They said, especially my dad, uh, always said that I, n that I didn't have to change my vibrato. I had to protect that vibrato and never ever change it because it was, it was, he always said that a voice without vibrato is not worth it, it's not a voice, you know? And so I kept my vibrato <laughs> and that's kind of my signature. Wow. Yeah. My thanks, goat, thanks, mom and dad. Goat Your goat yeah. signature, yeah. Uh, I know in New York, you were recently uh, at a Mets game and cheering on the Mets and I was like, Oh, yeah, I wonder how you do cheer at a game because you get very excited <laughs> when you're cheering for your sons, for your boys. I've seen. I do. I mean, I've I seen video. Away. You are one of those people. <laughs> one of those moms. Yeah, you're annoying one of, moms. Yeah, you just yeah. Go, you just go, yeah, and you scream. Yeah. I mean, yeah. can you? I mean, do people tell you to like chill I, out? Or? I embarrass my kids. <laughs> actually, yeah, during um, my little one, my, the both of them actually um, uh, practice taekwondo. 
Mm. And uh, and whenever they participate in the tournament, Taekwondo, they, I, I scream like a crazy woman. And and the, and the dojo master, last time, he gave me two warnings. <laughs> the second, and he said, You can't warn Shakira. No, 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 no. Yeah, he, he almost kicked me out. Oh, my God. Because I was like, kick him in the head, kick him in the head. You know, I... <laughs> no, she's I not kidding. In fact, away. we asked you if you have any video of you. We have a video of you cheering your son on when Sasha won first place in karate in Taekwondo. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> that's, that's a loving mom right there. That is a good mom. That is... It's so funny. Oh, my God. You would have thought that you won. Oh, my goodness. That's great. Uh, let's talk about your new uh, NBC series, as Dancing With Myself. Yeah. Uh, what is the idea behind this, uh, uh, this show? Um, to offer people from all walks of life uh, and all ages yeah. uh, a platform where they can showcase their talents, but also their passion for dance. You know, they don't have to be virtuosos. They don't have to be professionals. Uh, most of them aren't. Um, but I like that you're not looking to... at me, by the way. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> they just have to dance like you. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, they're... Yeah. The, they... the idea with the show is, is just to, to offer an opportunity and access to people from, yeah, from everywhere and... To dance. To dance and to show their true passion for dance, you know? Like, um, we had, for example, we had doctors on the show. We had construction workers, we had people in the military, we had dentists, a lot of dentists, actually. Wow. For some strange reason. It's almost, it was almost called Dancing <laughs> right. Dentists at first. They changed the title to Dancing With Myself. Uh, I know uh, uh, our buddy uh, Nick Jonas is on with you, too. Yeah. Uh, and, yeah, he's a good... He's awesome. Yeah, he's the best, and he... Between the two of you, I would never want to be in a dance contest. Um, <laughs> I, wanted, uh, I wanted to show a clip. Here's a look at Dancing With Myself. Check this out. Jeremy, can I ask you what you do for a living? Absolutely. So I am a plus size model in. Uh... Hey! You might not be the most technical dancer, but I don't care. Every time I see you dance, it, I don't know, it's something contagious, something infectious about what you're doing. <laughs> and I just want to see more of you. Can you show me a model, please? Yeah. Mm. Ooh, work, pose. No, pose. I smile. Pose. <laughs> I've never noticed that. Not once. <laughs> Work. <laughs> Work. <laughs> Do you have a mirror face? No. Come on, Nick. <laughs> hey, that's a lip bite. Yeah, that's how you do it right there. Uh, Shakira, everybody. Dancing with Myself premieres May 31st at 10 p.m. on NBC. Hey.